What's going on guys? Welcome back to another episode of Mondo Song. Today we are doing the Mystery Tackle Box Pond Hopping Slam Challenge. So I got my Mystery Tackle Box in the, in, in the mail today and I just picked it up. So we're gonna check out what's inside. So let's check this out. All right, so it's the Elite. It says reject, I don't know why, but it's just the Elite. And I got it in today, but I forgot to film me get. I have one more coming. So yeah. You got the the thing right there. All right, so let's see what we got. Okay, we got, so, rattling Google Eye swing football jig. That's pretty neat. Okay, flat crank. That's pretty cool. This one has like a smaller bridge on the top. What in the world, Savage Gear? If I ever saw this in the store, I would not use it, but it has an underspin tail on the back. <laughs> These look like they're for ocean saltwater fishing. Shad tail. Just little swimmers. And then we got some net bait in black and blue. These are pretty cool. And then, oh yeah, I love these hooks. Wide gap. These are cool. A mini jig. Okay, this is probably what I'm going to be throwing. What in the little crawfish? These like look real. Dude, this is too much stuff to catch something on. I'm probably not going to catch everything today. Oh, Shikoshi bugs. Okay, these are actually, I like these a lot. That would probably go really well on the back of that little jig or something like that. And then, oh, yeah, okay, we got some Guggen. A banger, just a regular banger. Dude, I don't actually have a regular. I always have the mini banger. Dude, that's actually pretty neat. I bet we can catch a fish on this. And then the sticker and the four ways to achieve the jig. Okay. Nice. I don't know what I'm going to throw on. Let me see. I'm thinking this. I'm sorry, Banger. Not today. Well, I, hopefully today, but not yet. Oh, I need a trailer for the jig. So I'm thinking this and the jig, but we got to find a trailer for the jig. I'm just thinking a little Sakoshi bug. There we go. Ready, rattle on that. You lock it? Yep. It's kind of stained water. Pretty murky. But it's also clear in certain spots. Nothing. What other ponds would we try? Sure. Alright boys, you're gonna go into a different pond. Oh man, there's a dead goose right here. Poor little goose. I have no idea this place was here. Oh yeah. Okay, think I had a fish. I'm gonna go to the right a little bit. Okay, guys. This is definitely where some fish are be. Right here. In the middle. Oh yeah, it's like every fish is pushed to be here. Got one. Got one. Let's go. Thank you, Lord. Yep. Got one, baby. Let's go. Yeah, man, they're swimming. Let's go, guys. Let's go. Check that out, guys. Guys, we're on the board with a pound and a half bass. Oh, I have to go switch out the bait. See you, guys. What's going on, guys? It's the next day. So we're getting ready to do the mystery tackle box challenge. I'm by myself because everybody's gone. And I just found this new pond on um, Google Maps that I'm going to be looking at. So... We're gonna go check that out. I don't know if it's a good spot at all. I don't even know if I'm allowed to fish it. I'm gonna try to get permission if I'm not allowed to. So, we'll see you guys there. Hi, how are you doing, sir? Is there a pond here? All right, do you, can I have your permission to go through there? Thank you, sir. You have a good one. Yo, dude, this is an actual pond. We got the rod covers off. Okay, it's actually perfect. So yesterday, 
I got the jig, I caught a fish on the jig, so we're done with the jig. Now, we have to figure out what I'm gonna throw. I have more line because that line's done. One, and what else we're we gonna throw? Dude, this, I wish I could use this crawfish. Hold on, I can rig that crawfish maybe. Wait, nope, I got an idea. Even though I already used the jig, if I use the jig, take off the trailer, and put on this trailer, this could work. This thing is weird, but we're gonna go with it. That turned out a lot better than I thought it would. First cast. How deep is this? I can't, oh, hit the bottom. Nope. Oh, we need to see what this jig looks like first. So the water is very stained, but it's not. Dude, this jig does not look bad. I would bite it if I was a fish. Later, I might have to ask somebody if I can fish her backyard so I can get out more. No way, no way. Got one. Guys, I got a fish. No way, is this a fish? No way. Come on, Brad. Zero. My legs are shaking. Come on. Get in the fish. Five nine, five eight, five. Okay, this is still as bigger. Five eight six. Let's go. Let me try to trust that you guys somewhere. Guys, look how big this is. Look how big this is. Literally, felt like I got snagged. Look at this. New pond, man. Guys, all I can say is just thank the Lord for giving me this fish. Let's send him off, dude. See ya, buddy. I'm gonna put the Shikoshi bug on that trailer. Oh, we have to get rid of this too. These are weird. Okay, that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna put, switch the trailer for this jig. Okay, there we go. Got enough, nope, just missed one, guys. Right here, that, that was a two pounder all day. 100% missed that fish. Oh, big one. Okay, this might this might be bigger. Oh man, guys, this is a killer fish. Okay, is this the same one? If you're five, six, okay, nope. Guys, look at that fish right there. Hooked right at the top of the mouth. Man, I can't tell if you're the same fish, man. Okay, okay, stop, stop. Oh, don't, don't. Okay, he's, I can't tell if this is the same fish. This is a big fish. He's definitely either, this, if he's 5'8", I'm gonna be like, actually, we caught the fish in the same twice in a row. Okay, if it's 5'8". Oh, he's smaller. He's 5'5". Five, five. Come on, Darwin. 5'5", five, 6'. Five, Guys, look at this fish. Man, Timmy and Ethan are gonna be jelly. Bye, fish. I did not mean to throw you like that. Oh, he's gone. Okay, boys, we gotta switch baits. I'm gonna switch to square bill. Kill a square bill action up in here. Okay, different pole. I hope I don't lose this. Okay, that's pretty cool right there. Whoa, this pole is different. Oh, that cut my finger. Where did it go? Where is it? Am I in a tree? How did I get in the tree? No. No. No, I just lost my kooky bait, guys. No. We can get it. What tree? Is it that one? Oh, I see it. Whoa, do not wear vans when you're wanting to climb a tree. Okay, is this a dead tree? Oh yeah, this is a solid dead tree. Leaning over a pond. Okay guys, I am literally 15 feet in the air. Okay, 
Is it worth it? Yeah, it's worth the banger. Oh man! I'm by myself, have no help. Come on, branch, break. Maybe I can shake it off. Yes, it worked. It's in the pond. Yes, and the wind is going this way. Oh, now we can see the other side of the pond. That's pretty nice. I'm definitely thinking I'm gonna move and ask somebody if I can fish your backyard. Me get in a different spot. God. Where is it? Oh, I see it. Totally hooked it. Yep, got it. Let's go. Look at that, man. Shoo! The hooks aren't even bent on this thing. That's why I like gigging. If that was something else, my hook would be off. Thank you for Porter Gray Fishing for sponsoring our video on our channel. Go to portergrayfishing.com to pick up yourself some fishing apparel that is super comfortable to wear. They also have this new selection of gaiters and some hats that you can go pick up for yourself today. Thank you, Porter Gray Fishing, for sponsoring our channel, and stay tuned. Dude, this is big. It's a huge U. You guys can't even see what I'm seeing. Okay, this is way bigger than I ever thought it would be. This is cool, though. So I'm going to switch to the crankbait and um, give this a shot. Dude, this is all open water. Oh, there's a dock, too. She can fish that dock. There's those ducks. Okay, this is, how deep is this? Okay, it's not as deep as I thought. It's like two, two and a half. Oh my, in the branch again. Okay, guys, I got a fish. Guys, I got a fish, no way. How am I going to get this? Oh, I got it, yes. Guys, yes, thank you, Lord. Let's go. Hold on. Okay, I think I can boat flip him. Oh, he's heavy. I was in a tree. Okay, he's not. He swallowed this thing. Okay. Here we go. I know. Hold on. Okay, guys, he's only three. I'm gonna let him go because he needs to be gone. Let go. He's bleeding pretty bad. Oh, you guys. Come on, buddy. Recover. He's bleeding real bad. Okay. Okay, right here. Oh man, come on, fish. There's only three more baits. Come on. Oh, got one. Yeah. Oh, fat daddy. Right on the edge. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. On the Guggen. All right. Um, I can't boat flip you. Yes, I can. Let's go. Oh, buddy. Thank you, Lord. Look at that fish, guys. Right on the cam. Oh, yeah. Whoa. You're two. You're two. You're two and a half. Because you're way shorter than I thought. This is as like, long as the one pounder I caught the other day. Dude, his colors inside his mouth. See in there? Okay. Okay. Oh yeah, I called it. It's two and a half. It's two point seven six. Bam. All right. Later, Junior. Oh yeah. Don't. He just. He darted in the wall. He needs to be thinking about brain surgery right now. Okay. So let's see what I have left. Okay, that's on that pole. So I have that one. Done with that, done with the, all of these. Okay, the last one is this for a hard bait. Okay. Dude, what is this? I am so confused. There's a blade. 
Okay, well we're gonna use it anyways and try to go cook up another one. Okay, what? Okay, this thing is interesting. You don't, you don't just reel this in, I don't think. Oh, it sinks? Okay, the fact, I think I'm not gonna catch a fish on this. I'm just gonna um, try to catch a fish on the last one and then we would have caught a fish on everything but this. Oh, sorry guys. Excuse me. Hope you guys enjoyed today's episode. Thank you so much for staying tuned and watching. We didn't quite finish the Grand Slam, but dude, we caught some good fish today. Like, look at this place. We had some awesome fishing and, and that was really awesome. Thank you for the people that let me fish their backyards and that was a really awesome day and i've literally been out here for five four and a half hours ish somewhere around that five but um yeah so thank you guys so much for watching and leave in your comments remember really put in the comments what is your personal best bass mine is now five eight six so if, let's let me know if you guys beat that and we'll see you guys in the next one thanks for watching out.